Hey, I'm Tashaka Armstrong, and welcome to another episode of Tech for the Rest of Us. Uh, let's say you want to learn guitar. Maybe your child, you have a young one at home who would like to learn guitar, but maybe you don't have the time to take them out for private instruction, or maybe you can't afford to have private instruction in home. Jamstick Plus has something that may be just the solution you're looking for. This electronic guitar or electric guitar that's wireless and connects to an iPad or iPhone via Bluetooth will provide your child with feedback, with interactive feedback, interactive lessons that all work via the app and the device. But can it really deliver the education needed for a child to pick up the guitar or for you to pick up the guitar for that matter? Let's check it out. So this is the Jamstick Plus. When you open up the box for the Jamstick Plus, you get some custom wood skins that you can place on the frets. You also get the guitar pick. You get the charging cable, uh, the travel charger, but and you get this shoulder strap here. But ultimately, the goods are all right here in the actual MIDI controller uh, that is the Jamstick. This connects to your iPad or iOS device via Bluetooth. So we're going to get right to that and show you how this works with the apps. There are a few different apps you can actually use with the Jamstick Plus. Uh, the Jamstick Plus app, Jamstick Tutor, or the Jam Tutor 1, Jam Tutor 2, four chords, and there are others. And specifically, what I'm going to show you is uh, Jam Tutor 1. That is the app that works in tandem with the Jamstick Plus controller so that you can have interactive lessons uh, teaching you how to play the guitar. So when you go into the Jamstick app, it's going to look for the Jamstick. You can then go in, tell it to connect Jamstick. It'll show up there and it'll say not connected. You go ahead and hit connect. It'll connect to the Jamstick and uh, then you can go ahead and get on with the lesson. Let's go ahead and make sure our sound is turned all the way up. It's turned all the way up on the iPad, and it's all the way up in the Jamstick app. So let's go and start a lesson. Let's start with the getting started, which as you can see, my son completed 83% of it. So this is lesson one. As you can see, it is going to walk you through uh, with visual cues Hi, and voice instruction. Now this can be used either with uh, the iPad on full sound or you can plug your headphones up to the jam stick. You can plug your headphones up to the iPad itself. Try placing the base of your jam stick on top of your right leg, supporting the net with your left hand. It should balance comfortably and your wrists should be loose and flexible. Let's move along so we can actually show you how to play single notes and what it actually walks you through. Holding the pick correctly is something that sounds incredibly simple, but there are many wrong ways to do it. Do yourself a favor and learn the correct grip now. Begin by making... As you can see, that was the pick. Now it takes you through strumming. When you use your pick to play multiple strings at once in a single stroke, it's called strumming. This was one of my son's favorite modes, which was arcade mode. So arcade mode allows you to actually go through uh, playing some notes, playing some chords. As you see, it may look a little familiar. It looks kind of like Guitar Hero or one of those other games. So for young players who are into video games, obviously this is going to look familiar, and sometimes familiarity breeds comfort. So this will make it so that the jam stick is something that's easier maybe for them to pick up because it's something that doesn't look so foreign to them. The zero coming down the low E string will stop on the row of zeros at the bottom of the screen. It will wait for you to play the low E string. Try it now. As you can see, I'm playing the wrong note. And the jam stick is lighting up where I'm hitting the frets. So that's the interactive portion of the jam stick. And as you can see, I hit the right note there at the right fret, so it allows me to move on. So I just learned the 
note E on the guitar. Stop on the roll of zeros at the bottom of the screen. Try playing just the A string as it crosses the zero in the button at the bottom of the screen. And there we go. Play the right note. Game moves on. G, B, and high E strings in series. Try playing each string individually as their zero crosses the zero in the buttons at the bottom of the screen. So that's arcade mode. Let's check out some of the other modes. Let's go into the open play. Now as you can see with open play, it's testing what you've already learned. So you have this map up here or this chart of different keys and chords. When you touch a key or chord, it's going to actually show you on the fret, on the neck of the graphic display here, what that key or chord looks like, and then you can go ahead and match that up with the proper key or chord. So you can see when you're touching the wrong ones, it lights up. When you hit the right ones, you get it to light up as well. And then you can play the proper chord, in this case, a C major, with the sound output through the iPad. So that's basically how the jam stick is going to walk you through all of your various lessons, interactive just like you see there. One of the things I like about the Jamstick Plus is that you can choose which guitar you want the Jamstick Plus to emulate. So by pushing a button, one of the buttons up here on the top of the uh, Jamstick Plus, you can cycle through a bunch of different instruments. 12-string uh, acoustic, smooth electric, sparkling electric, fast guitar wah, weeping wah, smart chords, sitar, banjo, upright bass, slap bass, and many, many, many more. There's quite a few you can actually go through. You can even uh, go back to a classic acoustic guitar. Uh, there you go. And one with uh, steel strings. So 12-string uh, acoustic. You get a bunch of different guitars. So if you're learning to play guitar or you're teaching a child, child's learning how to play guitar, they're going to get to cycle through a bunch of different sounds and kind of find what... Uh, kind of guitar they like without you actually having to buy or go rent or try out several guitars. So that's a pretty neat feature of the Jam Stick Plus. So let's play a couple of those for you here. Let's see. All in all, this really is about what you're willing to do, what you want to do. If you're going to put some time into the study and the effort of learning this guitar, this jamstick, you're going to get out of it what you put into it. It's definitely uh, easy to follow. It's definitely a very solid interactive uh, lesson that you get out of the jamstick plus and the various apps. Let's go into four chords. So I've chosen a song, it was Royals, and you can see it actually asks you if you know these chords. You know, great choice, this song has these chords, D, C, and G. Then you can say either I know these chords, let's go, or I don't know these chords yet. When you say I don't know these chords yet, you can learn the chords. So now it gives you the option to go ahead and learn those three chords. So it'll pull up a video now you can see it's linked to YouTube, so it's actually going to run you through playing this video. So this part won't be interactive with the guitar itself, but it will give you uh, the necessary instruction to play those chords if you hadn't already learned those chords through the Jamstick Tutor 1 or the Jamstick Tutor 2 apps. Okay, here we are for our look at our first chord. This is it. This is D. And this is the first chord that we're going to be learning. So you definitely have so many options with this app. You definitely have many options with this product to learn the chords, to learn to play. And then uh, as you advance, it will keep up with you and challenge you with even more uh, uh, challenging chords. Uh, so that is the Jamstick Plus. Again, I let my son use this and without, with as little help from me as possible so that he could see 
if it was something that was going to work for him and so that I could see if it was something that you could actually give to a teen, to a preteen, uh, tween with uh, little help if you're not in a position to be able to sit with them and go over this with them. So that's the Jamstick Plus. It isn't perfect, but it really will go a long way toward helping you teach your child or helping you learn how to play guitar. There are some caveats as we noted in the review if you'll go over to foxla.com and check that out. But overall, if you really are interested in learning the guitar and getting a start, this is a pretty solid way to get you going. I'm Tashaka Armstrong. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out with us. If this helped you, please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, we will answer them. Leave them in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching.